We're celebrating excellent educators in the East again today with our WITN Teacher of the Week, Gracie Baker. She's a math teacher from Aiden Grifton High School and an avid teacher. So good morning. Thanks for being here. Thank you for having me. Okay, so you teach mostly freshman math and you also teach the avid program. Can you tell us about the avid program, what it is and what you do? Um, so it's a it's a program that gets students prepared for um, whatever they have coming next. So it's like mm -hmm. a career and college readiness program. We do a lot with, you know, making sure students know about the opportunities available to them. We do some college visits. Um, we do a lot with preparing them, like, on how to fill out college applications, doing interviews. We do some public speaking stuff. I wish um, I would have had that. Yeah, <laughs> it's a really cool program. Yeah. And with that, you're also teaching math, so you've got mm -hmm. multiple roles at Aiden Grifton. How does it feel to juggle all those? Um, it's like never a dull moment. Um, <laughs> it's, teaching is definitely a, a, sub, or a, a career where you get to, you know, always stay on your toes. Um, you never get bored, so um, it's really fun. Yeah. And so you, we were talking earlier and you had shared with me that you grew up at Aiden Grifton. That's mm -hmm. where you graduated high school from. You went to ECU and now you're back teaching there. What does that mean in a full circle moment? Did you think that that's what you would end up doing? Um, I mean, I've always loved my high school that I went to. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of the people that inspired me to be teachers, um, I got the opportunity to teach with, which was really cool. Um, they became some of my mentors. Um, which is really awesome. I currently still teach with one um, who <laughs> definitely inspired me to be a teacher. Um, so yeah, it's been really awesome just to be a part of that community. And now your kids, you have a freshman and a sophomore mm -hmm. in high school. Yeah. Um, what does it mean to be teaching them as well as the other students that are going to be our future? Um, it's been really cool, especially this year. Um, my son, a lot of his friends are currently my students. So it's been really <laughs> cool. Like I've known them since they were, you know, tiny. And now I get to be their teacher. Um, and then also I get the opportunity, you know, to teach one of my kids next year, which is going to be really, really cool. That's yeah. definitely a unique experience. Can't yes. say that I've had it, but mm -hmm. you're also teaching math. And yeah. earlier she said, guys, she had said that math is creative and I want her to elaborate on that because I grew up in that you have to do it this way or it's gonna be wrong so what do you mean by yeah that? so to, to me math has always been about you know finding patterns and relationships amongst numbers um, mm -hmm. really it's like a big puzzle you have to figure out how to solve <laughs> and there is always more than one way to do it so mm -hmm. to me it is a really creative subject you know you think of writing and stuff like that being creative but math can be creative too anything yeah. that you're looking forward to to round out the end of the school year um, I mean, spring break's next week, so that's going to be <laughs> awesome. Um, but yeah, graduation's always really exciting, you know, seeing the kids, yeah. you know, celebrate that milestone. So that's going to be really cool in June. All right. Well, yeah. Ms. Baker, you are our WITN Teacher of the Week. So glad that you were here this yeah. morning.